One of the most stunning locations on the last reef is um, Jellyfish Lake, which is a, it's a, a, a landlocked lagoon, isn't it, Effect, effectively, where the jellyfish have, have lost their power of sting. Um, so you can literally just swim through hordes of jellyfish and they'll bump off your face and it's the most amazing feeling and they're visually very, very arresting. Basically, it's an, a rock island that the centre is sunken and so water, uh, salt water, is getting into the centre of this island and it just looks like a, a lake in, in the middle of a jungle but it's full of um, jellyfish, teeming with jellyfish. Filming this location, we basically had to mount a mini expedition over a small mountain, taking the entire crew, all the camera equipment, um, up and down this over this small mountain that was uh, in basically a rainforest with slippery rocks that were very sharp. That if you slipped and fell, it would cut your leg. Special sauce. Once all the gear got over the mountain, we had to assemble everything at the edge of this lake, which is inside of a canopy of trees. In a storm, at times we would rely on the locals to say it's going to rain and literally sometimes 15 seconds later it was a full torrential downpour and you're trying to get this delicate electronics inside of a housing and prep to go underwater in this lake. Then once we got the camera prepped finally and in the water, uh, we had to swim in it almost a half a mile across the lake to where the jellyfish were and we had to use rebreathers in order not to disturb the jellyfish, but you could only go down to a certain depth for a certain amount of time because you got into a toxic layer and uh, it could eventually permeate through your skin. So we had to limit our exposure and uh, it was a very challenging location. Hard work. It was hard work. It's like uh, it a lot of sweat and a lot of tears. It's like a scene from Fitz Caraldo. Mm. But it was worth it. The, the end shots were great, but it was an absolute, it was a trial. It makes me cry thinking about it.